All right, thanks guys. The Nats take on the Cubs, 220 Chicago. The Cubs are 145. No total posted as of yet. Five cent fate of the Cubs. Hellickson's for Washington. Hendricks for Chicago. The Cubs dropped two of their last four. Washington's 10 and 6 when Hellickson makes the start. 13 out of 16 Hellickson starts also stayed under the line. I'm going to vouch for the underdog Washington in a slight upset here. And I am also very interested in this total here. If it opens up at 7.5 or higher, I'm going to go ahead and lean toward the under in it as well, despite the wind direction in that one. And with that said, welcome to the show. Got some lines and personal leans out for Friday's MLB action. But before we get into that, I just want to remind you to check out my daily best play. And that's at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And with a documented win percentage of 60% for the entire year of 2017, you're hurting yourself each and every day you're not subscribed. Packages begin at just $1.99 a month. There's also plenty of free content there as well. So once again, please feel free to check me out at patreon.com slash Brock Page. I also want to give a quick shout out, a big thank you to my headline sponsor for today's program. That's Jimmy and the boys at GhostPixATS.com. And if you like making money on sports, there's no reason why you shouldn't check out one or more of their very affordable money-making packages. That's Jimmy and the boys at GhostPixATS.com. That's GhostPixATS.com. And without any further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at our Friday slate of baseball games and personal leans. All starts Eastern Standard Time. And on deck, we've got Red Sox Orioles, 705 Baltimore. The Bo Sox are $1.95, totals $9.15 cents shaded toward the Red Sox. Yovaldi's for Boston, Bundy's for Baltimore. The O's dropped 10 of 12 to the Sox. They've also dropped 21 of 26 at the current market price. Baltimore's 22 and 12 to the under at home when the line was 9 or higher. Got to lean under in this one. Give me the Red Sox run line and the under. Nine runs. Next game, Rangers, Yankees. That's 705 New York. The Yankees are 210, totals nine. Miners for Texas, Tanaka's for New York. The Yankees are 36 and 14 as the home favorite. Texas won just four of 16 at the current money line price. Four out of four head to head matchups between these two squads got over the line. Got to take the faves in this one. Give me the Yankees run line and the over nine runs. <clears throat> Next game, Rays, Blue Jays, 707 Toronto. The Rays are $1.15, totals 8.5, 15 cent fate of Tampa. We got Blake Snell for the Rays, Marco Estrada for Toronto. Toronto's won just 8 of 28 as the home underdog. They've also dropped 5 of 6 head to head matchups with Tampa Bay. 5 and 1 to the under in those contests as well. Got to fade the public in this one. Give me the Rays outright in the under, 8.5. Next game, D-backs, Reds, 7-10, Cincinnati. Arizona's a buck and a quarter, totals nine and a half. Buckholz is for the D-backs, DeSclafani's for the Reds. Since he's won just 15 of 38 as the home dog, Arizona's won 11 of 15 after a day off. Eight and three to the over when DeSclafani makes the first pitch. Got to take the faves, give me Arizona outright in the over, nine and a half. Next game, Twins, Tigers, 7-10, Detroit. Twins are 115, totals 9. Santana's for the Twins, Zimmerman's for the Tigers. Detroit's just 39% in their games as the dog. Minnesota's a perfect 3-0 in Santana starts since he joined the staff. Five out of six head-to-head -head matchups between these teams fell under the line. Got to take the faves in this one. Give me the Twins outright in the under. Nine runs. Next game, Mets-Marlins. Seven ten Miami. The Mets are a dollar five total seven and a half. Wheelers for New York. Urena's for Miami. The Marlins dropped eleven of fifteen following an off day. New York's actually five thirty six versus losing ball clubs. Seven out of nine head to head matchups between these squads fell under the line. Got aside with the defense in this one. Give me the Mets outright in the under seven and a half. Next game Brewers Braves seven thirty five Atlanta. The Brewers are $1.15, totals 8.5. 70% of the tickets are shaded toward Atlanta. We got Peralta for Milwaukee. 
Gossman for the Braves. Atlanta's dropped three of four with the Brewers. Milwaukee's 70% when Peralta makes the start. 3-1 to the over in these teams' four head-to-head matchups. Got to fade the public. Give me the Brewers outright in the over, 8.5. Next game, Indians-White Sox, 8-10 Chicago. The Indians are $1.35, totals 9. We got Bieber for Cleveland, Rodon for Chicago. The Sox have won just 9 of 35 when taking on winning ball clubs. Cleveland's gone 8-2 and two in their 10 head-to-head matchups with Chicago. The Sox did go 21-14 and 14 to the under versus winning ball clubs. Got to take the defense in this one. Give me the Indians outright and the under nine runs. Next game, Mariners, Astros, 8-10 Houston. The Astros are 2-10, total 7.5, 20 cent fate of the Strohs in the early going here. Leaks for the Mariners, Coles for Houston. Houston does struggle against winning ball clubs, just 18 and 21 versus teams over 500. Seattle's 15 and 8 when Leak throws out the first pitch. Seattle's 86% to the over on the road when the line was 7.5. Got to vouch for the offense in this one. Give me the underdog Mariners catching the plus money in the over 7.5. Next game Cardinals Royals 815 Kansas City. The cards are $1.55, totals 9. 15 cent fade of St. Louis. We got Gomer for the cards, Smith for KC. Casey's won just 11 of 44 as the home underdog. St. Louis is 636 in their games at the current market price. Three out of three head to head matchups between these squads fell under the line. Got to fade the betting public in this one. Give me the Cardinals outright in the under, nine flat. Next game Dodgers Rockies, that's 840 Colorado. The Dodgers are $1.15, totals 11. Maeda's for the Dodgers, Gray's for the Rockies. The Rockies are 25 and 15 versus winning ball clubs. LA's won just 8 of 19 when Maeda throws the first pitch. Maeda starts, did go 14 and 5 to the under. Got a vouch for the defense again. Give me the underdog Rockies and the under 11 runs. Next game, Phillies, Padres, 10 10 San Diego. Phil's are $1.40, totals 8. Eflin's for the Phils. Jason, is that Jacob? <laughs> Jacob Nix makes his first start for San Diego. I think that was a typo here on the, on my website. Not my website, but the website I get my info from. It's Jake and Nix. No, I think it's Jacob Nix. But anyway, he's making his first start for San Diego. The Pods won just 13 of 47 as the home dog. Phillies 31 and 16 in their games laying the juice. Now two out of three head-to-head matchups between these squads got over the line. I think we'll see some scoring in this one. Give me the Fightins outright in the over eight runs. And that is going to bring me into my next and final game for the show. It is going to be Pirates-Giants. And before I get into that, I know at times I, I might skip over games like this one right here, A's-Angels. The reason for that is because I can't find a line for that game. So don't think I'm just skipping these games. I know I've seen some comments where, hey, man, you, you know, you forgot, you know, the Yankees. This is an important game. Well, if I skipped over it, it means because there was no line for it at the moment when I did my recording of the show. All right. <laughs> anyway, I need content and I need good games. So I'm not doing it on purpose. But anyway, we're going to slide in our next and final game for the show. Once again, that is going to be Pirates Giants. 1015 San Francisco. The Giants are $1.30, totals eight. Holmes for the Pirates, Holland for the Giants. San Fran's 20 and 14 as the home favorite. Pittsburgh's won just 20 of 43 as the road underdog. Holland starts went 15 and 6 to the under. Gotta take the home team. Give me the Giants outright and the under eight flat. And that is going to do it for me. But before I get out of here, Just have to remind you to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And with a documented win percentage of 60% for the entire year of 2017, you're hurting yourself each and every day you're not subscribed. Now, packages begin at just $1.99 a month. There's also plenty of free content there as well. So once again, please feel free to check me out at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And I also want to give a... uh, Big shout out and remind you to check out my headline sponsor. That's Jimmy and the boys at ghostpicksats.com. 
Jimmy and his team of young, hungry, expert consultants at Ghost Picks are the most passionate in the business. And if you thought I was good at handicapping games, these guys are amongst the best in the industry. And as always, thank you for watching today's program. I hope you enjoyed all this great free information. And please don't forget to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash brockpage.